I'm Alan Bresnik from Light Reading. We're here in New Orleans at SCT Cable Tech Expo, and I'm speaking to Yogan Patel from Amdocs. Hi, Yogan. Hi. Good to have you here. Thank you. So you were part of our breakfast this morning about cable and 5G. Why is 5G so interesting to cable? What kind of role do you think cable is going to play in it? Yeah, so you know, compared to other mobile generations, mm -hmm. the thing about 5G is that there are a few new things coming along that make it more relevant to cable. So the first is this whole notion of quality of service based on things like edge compute and slicing. Right. So the 5G network by nature is going to be a hybrid network that's going to require a lot of in-ground infrastructure to support it as well. Mm -hmm. And the cable guys have that. So uh, number one, right off the bat, the fact that you know cable has big infrastructure in the ground, which really augments the capabilities that the wireless providers have in order to deliver new services is a big advantage and a different thing for the, for the uh, cable operators. The second thing is CBRS. So interestingly, 5G is coming along at the same time CBRS has come along, where now there's a spectrum that the government's being made available on a shared basis, which cable operators can take advantage of as well right. in order to deliver specific services. So when you put the fact that the 5G architecture is going to require you know, densification and in-ground assets along with CBRS, 5G is a different proposition that makes it interesting for cable operators compared to previous mobile generations. What do you see as the first use cases for cable and 5G? So I think the, the first use case will be primarily in the area of fixed wireless access. So one thing we've heard over and over again from cable operators is that in many cases, they're going to use fixed wireless access as a means to extend the reach of their HFC infrastructure, right? right. So right off the bat, you'll see the opportunity for cable operators to use CBRS in some cases right. uh, to be able to augment what they have in the ground today to provide broadband through fixed wireless access. That's going to one. The other area of opportunity is going to be mainly on private networks and more location-specific use cases where you don't need to have a huge blanketed wireless network. We can go into a specific area, uh, leverage spectrum through something like CBRS and your infrastructure that you have to support enterprise use cases, private network use cases. Those will be the two that will be most relevant probably to cable operators as they look at 5G and wireless services. What is Amdoc's role in enabling cable operators to do 5G? Okay, that's a good question. So there's really three pieces that Anbox brings to the table. Um, the first is we're actually a SaaS provider for CBRS. So right off the bat, if a cable operator wants to take advantage of a CBRS, we can deliver to them the spectrum access service capability. But that's just the first piece. The other area we can help uh, cable operators when it comes to 5G and wireless is all around wireless network design, wireless network planning, integration, acceptance, optimization. So for these wireless, for companies that have been in wireless a long time understand what RAN is and understand what it means to manage that spectrum and build other wireless networks. Cable operators don't have that ability and Amdocs can provide the services to do planning, design, integration, acceptance, optimization. And then the third area is all around being able to help them operate and create a smarter network based on things like network function virtualization, SDN, because when you think about 5G, it's not just the new radio, but it's also re-architecting the core with edge and slicing and NFV, and we have solutions and capabilities that can support them with that piece of the journey as well. So 5G and virtualization together. That's right, that's okay. right. So, yep. so it's the, the, the network services and the core technology that goes together as well, right? Okay, Yogan, thanks for your time. Okay, thank you very much.